In this precious moment of twilight reflection, we come together to elevate our spirits and seek divine wisdom for the journey that lays before us. Life's journey is sculpted by various influences, and tonight, we direct our meditative focus towards one force that frequently guides our actions, that is pride. Dear kindred spirits, as we gather here, let us acknowledge that pride can often cloud our judgment, silently urging us to place ourselves on pedestals. Yet as we come together in unity, we remember the profound words of Micah 6, 8, which says, He has shown you, O mortal, what is good, and what does the Lord require of you, to act justly and to love mercy and to walk humbly with your God. In this space of humility, we beseech the divine to cleanse our hearts from the clutches of pride. Friends, as we venture into this period of deep reflection, let us look upon the hallowed scriptures for guidance. The words in 2 Timothy 3.16 remind us, All scripture is God-breathed and is useful for teaching, rebuking, correcting, and training in righteousness. This call beckons us to inspect the true sources of our motivations and the paths we choose to tread. As we stand here today, let us individually ponder what really governs our actions. Is it the seduction of pride, the chase for personal accolades, or the transient temptations of earthly pleasures? Allow the light of Psalm 25, 4, 5 to guide our way. Guide me in your truth and teach me, for you are God my Savior and my hope is in you all day long. Show me your ways, Lord, teach me your paths. In these divine words, we find a compass to navigate a journey aligned with heavenly purpose. Within the complex mosaic of life, a constant battle emerges between our terrestrial desires and the beckoning of the Spirit. 1 John 2.15, 16 warns us, do not love the world or anything in the world. If anyone loves the world, love for the Father is not in them. For everything in the world, the lust of the flesh, the lust of the eyes, and the pride of life, comes not from the Father, but from the world. To truly embark on a path of light is to immerse ourselves in the teachings and emulate the life of Jesus Christ. We are encouraged by the stirring words of 2 Corinthians 4.18. So we fix our eyes not on what is seen, but on what is unseen, since what is seen is temporary, but what is unseen is eternal. This profound statement encourages us to cultivate faith that guides us through life's intricacies with a focus on eternal truths. At life's numerous junctions of decision, let our hearts echo the supplication of Psalm 32. 8. I will instruct you and teach you in the way you should go. I will counsel you with my loving eye on you. With genuine hearts, we seek the Lord to guide our path, saving us from the pitfall of temptations. Our souls crave the heavenly direction, akin to dry lands longing for nourishing rain. In unity, our voices merge in fervent prayer. Dear Jesus, remove the barricades that hinder our hearts from sensing your divine guidance. Let the Holy Spirit act as our true helper, providing comfort, counsel, conviction, and direction. We call upon the Spirit to steer our journey, granting us the strength to surmount obstacles and maintain a sturdy stance. We entreat you, Lord, to shower your Spirit upon us, granting discernment and wisdom to discern the gentle nudging of your Spirit amidst the world's clamor. As we yield to the intervention of the Holy Spirit, let us be reassured by Romans 15, 13. May the God of hope fill you with all joy and peace as you trust in him, 
so that you may overflow with hope by the power of the Holy Spirit. In this sacred assembly, we pledge our allegiance to a pathway of purpose. We choose to reject worldly allurements, fend off sinful tendencies, and embrace the stewardship of the Holy Spirit. Our joy is found in your word, O Lord, where we find comfort, fortitude, and deeper meaning. Beloved souls, as we conclude this prayerful gathering, remember the comforting words of Joshua 1, 9. Have I not commanded you? Be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid. Do not be discouraged, for the Lord your God will be with you wherever you go. Know that you are not alone in your journey. Let God's word be the navigational tool that guides you through the challenges and triumphs that lie ahead. As we connect in this serene moment, let us offer a heartfelt prayer. Gracious Father, we humbly approach your presence, seeking your divine guidance and insight. Let your word be a lamp illuminating our path, directing us towards your sublime will. Assist us in shedding pride and worldly desires, empowering us to walk with humility and faithfulness in your paths. Infuse us with your Holy Spirit, helping us discern your voice in the midst of world's noise and to follow your guidance with unflinching faith. We entrust ourselves to you, confident of your continual assistance and guidance. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen. Subscribe to Empowering Daily Prayers for a guided journey of spiritual upliftment.